present to me? From me? Oh, me, you shouldn't have. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting you quite yet. You know, with Valentine's Day fast approaching, we thought, what better way to prepare for whatever romantic entanglement may occur than building a steamy romance story bot. Let's get this soiree started. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna start off with a bot I already have, the Hans Fletcher Dating and Life Coach. Um, and ignore the fact that apparently I've got some action needed. I'm breaking some rules, haven't updated this bot for the changes coming later in 2020. But no worry, let's um, get started and uh, make this thing happen. So we'll head down to flows and create a new flow. We'll call it something creative like romance bot. Yeah, I like it. All right, so this should be pretty familiar. It's just a simple content block and I should warn you this bot's not terribly sophisticated anyway, but I thought it'd be fun to create something a little new, a little different than uh, what you normally see. So, start with our story. Our protagonist is uh, Kip Handsomeson. His love options include Betty Ladyton and Greta Hug and Kiss. Uh, at some point I realized that no one really wants to watch me build a bot for 16 minutes, so we're gonna speed through the boring parts and just see how this thing goes. You'll see, uh, you know, you build your image and text blocks. We're gonna build out a tree of different options. So this can be a choose your adventure style romantic entanglement. All right, here we go. We're going and building out the Betty Ladyton storyline. So here we go. Once again, we'll have some branching options. Oh, yes. This is getting good. All right, let's let's keep going. All right, so we'll put the uh, inviter over, some text, a little romance, a little something something. And once again, this shouldn't be, you shouldn't get lost at this point if you realize that I'm just creating branching storylines. Your bot, romantic or otherwise, can do the same. All right, then we uh, head in here. Let's let's. Just Tell Greta's story. Greta's not the same as Betty. It's uh... okay. We'll keep on going in. Oh, yeah, this is, this is hot and heavy. <laughs> Romance! All right, here we go. And uh, I wanted that couch not to always be an option. And so what we'll do here is we'll link everything. Anywhere we mentioned couch is getting linked down to this one block. Here we go. So all roads lead to couch. So we hit publish. And then because I want to make this available as kind of like an Easter egg within the spot, um, I'm gonna have it so you can type in romance as a keyword and it'll load up the romance story. So any of you can actually go to the Hans Fletcher Dating and Life Coach bot and do this for yourself. So we'll build it as a messenger flow and make sure the keyword, make sure the keyword selects the right flow. And then we're done. We can switch on over to the phone and let's give it a shot. All right, I'm just excited, so. Talk to the bot, type in the secret keyword. All right, here we go, all right. So you know what I'm thinking, yeah, Betty Ladyton. Oh, yeah, all right, let's, let's invite her over. Yeah, Gip's pretty embarrassed about it, house being a mess, but you know, they get freaky anyway. Well, I certainly hope this titillating tale we've crafted inspires you to go out and build the best bot you've ever made. Give your bot personality, character, drama. The customer experience from get started to buy this should be riveting, engaging, something we're sharing. Get out there and keep on building. I know I am. <laughs> 